you know, what they've written. But then you really never know them until you buy the book. So my advice to you is buy your friends' books, because you never really know them until you read their book. And all the and this, and, and included this late young lady here and this gentleman here. In April, I love your culture today. Thank you very much. Um, this is my friend Armando Ebenez. It's called Wrestling with the Angel. And, uh, and uh, yes, and he, he uh, has a film that's coming out. Uh, he's in Texas right now, so he's left, so um, I can't tell him what I feel about this poem. But his uh, film will go on, I believe, in another few months. Uh, it will be in LA. This poem is from his book, Wrestling with the Angels, and it's called Mysterio. Mysterio. So, how apropos for All Saints Day. Mm -hmm. Poetry. Mysterio. Mystery. You are darkness of light. Wherever you walk, I see my blindness and am blinded by the light. Mystery, Mysterio, shadow of light. I feel your embraces in the night, whispering breath. Seeping into my nostrils, I smell your words. I utter, I groan. God, my Lord, I see you dressed in shadows and silhouettes. Mysterio, you are here. I'm alone, naked, mystery. You are in love with me. How can I hug and kiss the wind? I'm alone. You are here. Mysterio, naked. Your beauty melts the darkness into light, and the light into darkness. Sight and blindness. Oh, Mysterio, mystery. You are Mysterio. I am in love with you. <clears throat> And the second book um, I'd like to read an excerpt from is from a man I don't know. His name is Brian Hicks, but he wrote a very good book called Ghost Trip. I know I'm a day late, but this is in honor of Halloween. And it's a very good book, by the way. <laughs> Sorry about the Marie Celeste. Well, I'm getting to that, yes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Brian Hicks. It's called Ghost Ship. Locating shipwrecks is never easy. But in the case of Mary Celeste, researchers and divers at least had something to go on. When the ship was intentionally wrecked in 19, 1885, the trial that followed offered promising leads. In most cases, NUMA divers do their work in deep water far offshore often in near zero visibility. So they were pleasantly surprised to learn that, if nothing else, they would be searching in clear, shallow, and warm water. The Mary Celeste had done them the courtesy of sinking in paradise. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't come prepared today, and I admit that I just wrote a little poem about an experience I had last night. So bear with me. I might actually make it a poem, but it's just an experience I'm sharing with you from last night. Decoration witch, hanging from the tray, the tree, swaying in the dark, swaying in the dark. I'll get a photo quick before the rain, if I can, if I can. As the camera clicks, if I can, if I can, she comes to life. Can it be the night? Am I all right? Is the black magic of the house, or am I insane? Is it a clue? No, I'm not insane. It is the energy of the night. I am the light. I choose the light. Not the witch riding on a broom, hanging from the tree with a trick 
of the light, with the trick of the light. Mm. <laughs>